hey everyone welcome back to another video it is your girl batty of course and in today's video we are cash stuffing 965 dollars i had a dream last night did everything i never do in real life i stepped into a room told everyone to be quiet because i had something to say to everybody away of course we're going to start with our positive quotes let me grab a card and we will see what that quote is for today one day or day one you decide oh cool remember the times you wish you had started something earlier in life maybe it's investing learning a new skill or exercising motivate yourself Today, go start what you've been putting off. Oh my God. They could have never said that any better. Honestly. Like, I don't even have anything to add to that. They topped it off perfectly. <laughs> so we're gonna jump right into the stuffing. Um, we have our little bank bag right here. And we're gonna take out the cash and we're going to count our cash. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, that's 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 4, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 5, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 6, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 7, so we have 700. Plus we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So that's eight, so plus 40. We have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. That's nine, plus 100. And we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65. So we have 965. So today our $965 will be split between Builds Binder, High Priority, and Saving Challenges. So let us get started. I'm going to turn this thing sideways to make a little more space for the table. So let's start with our Builds Binder. Um, for our Builds Binder, we are going to jump right into the stuffing. For rent, we are adding $300 to rent. So we have... 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. So we are adding 300 to rent. Let's recount 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Okay. So 300 to our rent this month work hasn't been that fast like last month was so we are not yet at our full bills but the goal is definitely to get there and we will we definitely will get there um next we have utilities and for utilities today we are adding 35 dollars, and that's my only five dollars so let's see we have 20 35 So we have $35 to add to utilities. So, so far we're down 300 and we're down 35. So we should have 565 remaining. Next, we're adding to phone bill and for phone bill, we are adding $60. That's half of the phone bill. So we're doing one, two, three. We're adding 60 to phone bill. And then we have another 60 to add to complete phone bill. Next, we have car insurance. Um, we're only adding 75 to car insurance, which I'm going to need change. So car insurance, we're adding 75. So we have 20, 30, 60, 75. So 20, 40, 60, 75 for car insurance. And if you guys remember, I told you my car insurance amount reduced because my boyfriend now pays half of it for me. So, yep, now I only pay $150. Next, we have car payment. Into car payment, we're adding $120. So we have one, two, 
three, four, five, six, 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. So 120 to car payments. I'm gonna try to add another $80 to that, makes it 200 before the 20th of this month, because that's when it's due. So we'll see. Next we have subscriptions. Subscriptions, we are adding $40 to subscriptions. So we have, or 40 to subscriptions. And that is it for the bills binder. So in total we add 300 plus the 35 for utilities, the 60 for phone, the 120 for car payment, the 75 for car insurance, and $40 for subscriptions, which makes it $630. And that is it for our bills stuffing. Now we're gonna jump into high priority and let us stuff our high priority binder. To emergency, we're adding $30. So let's add 30 to emergency. We add 20 and a 10 makes it 30. And now for emergency, we have 120, 40, 60, 70, 80. So we have 180 in emergency. For debts, we are adding $25 to debt. So let's add our 25, 20, and a five. So we make that 20, 40, 60, 80, $85 to debt. For supplies, we are adding $30 to supplies. So let's add our $30 to supplies. After adding 30, we made it 20, 30, 40, 45 to supplies. For health, we are adding $5 to health. I don't have five, so I'm gonna put down the five and I'm gonna take up 10. So in total, now debt has 30 bucks. Next, we have some new categories that were added. We have taxes. For taxes, we are adding $20 to taxes today. It's a new category, so it doesn't have much in there. Pretty much empty. We have my graduation, which is coming up, which we are adding $25 to today. Let me use two tens and a five. Two tens and a five. So $25 added to my graduation. I'm really excited to graduate. I'm graduating in December. For apartments, we don't need it now. I think we're gonna renew our lease. But look at this piece of here. We're gonna renew our lease again for this apartment, but I wanna start putting up money for an another apartment if we're gonna lease next year or we're gonna buy, I'm not sure, but I wanna start putting up for that. So I'm gonna put $20 to apartment today. And then last but not least, we have babysitter, which I'm adding $10 to. That's if I need, because I do realize I didn't have babysitter for my daughter. And I didn't put my daughter's binder because I kind of want it to be more of a higher priority where I will have to, you know, put up money for it in case I need it. Because sometimes now I just be so busy, so tired. Sometimes even when I'm home, I just want someone to be here to just watch her for me while I work and do what I'm doing. So that's it for the high priority binder. And next binder we are adding into is our saving challenge binders. So we have just added 165 to high priority. So we should have $170 remaining to stuff or saving challenges. So the first saving challenge I want to jump into today, I'm gonna put 170 here. And I'm going to jump into our my new saving challenge, which I have this binder for. Cute, right? It's like a sticker binder. 
and it is the scratch and save saving challenge it's not really new because I did start it last time so I'm gonna jump into my scratch and save and I'm going to pick just one today so I'm gonna pick one thing one circle to scratch and to put that amount down so the circle I would like to choose is any mini mining bowl catch up by so if you ever let them go any mini my bowl <laughs> it's gonna be this way y'all okay so with scratching this we are putting down ten dollars today in our scratch and save saving challenge and we currently have let's put the ten dollars and then we'll see how much we have and since we have two fives probably we should make change with that so now with the ten dollars added we have 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 so we currently have $90 in our um, scratch and save envelope. So I do have roll the dice. Um, we're going to do the roll the dice. We're going to get that started today. So let me go ahead and pick one of these. So for the roll the dice challenge, we are going to roll our dice and we're gonna see how much money we need to put down today so these are available on my website if you guys are interested but let's get the roll in chicka 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 five and two is what came up on our dice so we're gonna look here it says for five we have to put on a twenty dollar bill and for a two, we have to put down 10. So in total, we're putting down $30 today for the roll the dice. So we did one five. We're gonna wipe out our five. And we did a two. We're gonna wipe out the two. So we have 20, 30. So we subtract 10 and we subtract 30. We're left with $130. So roll the dice was new. So it didn't have anything in there. So we now have $30 in there. So these are my other mini saving challenges that are on my website. But we're going to start only these two. Being that we already have the saving challenge book going. The coloring book and the 100 envelope box then we're just going to keep the scratch and save and the roll the dice. And then when we're finished with either one or two of these, we'll continue to the rest. So that's it for this binder today. Now we're jumping into our saving challenge binder. Let's see where we at, where we about to be. Y'all know this is my favorite binder. <laughs> you see how it's fat? Yeah, it's my favorite. So we have $130 remaining and today we are going to add to the saving challenge binder and we're going to add to the 100 envelope binder. So let's see how much money we want to add here and how much money we're going to add to 100, the 100 envelope. We have $130. We're going to add $90 to this challenge. So let's see. We're going to add $90 to our 250 dollars challenge today. So we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 90, 90. Okay, here. 90 stops here. So today we're adding $90 to our saving challenge book. And then whatever remainder we have left over, we're going to add that to the 100 envelope. So let me just go ahead and shade in my heart. How's everything going for you guys? I want to know how your process is going. How much money were you able to save so far since you have started? How's everything going? I like to know the information. Like I know you guys love to come over here and watch me do my thing. But I also want to know how y'all's thing going. You know, because it's a teamwork make the dream work over here. Okay, we are all a team and we are trying to get to a certain goal in our financial lives. So let's share it, you know. Comment below 
and share your goals, share where you're at, share how far you've been, how hard your process has been, and what you were able to overcome. I can tell you guys that it has not been an easy road for me. I always say that all the time. But it definitely hasn't been an easy road for me. I try my best to save as much as I can because I'm not used to this. In no way am I used to this. So whenever I can, I try my best to save because it feels good to have money put down for rainy days. It feels good to know that when a rainy day arrives, I have money. I don't have to be, you know, depending on anyone or calling on anyone to assist me because I can't assist myself. So it feels great. So let's add our $90 to our 250 challenge. So we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. So we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. So we're adding $90 to our $250 challenge, which now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. So we have $210. So we have $40 more to go, and we will be completing our $250 challenge. And we'll be moving on to the next one in our nine piece saving challenge. Wow, this feels amazing! Amazing, I tell you. So let's finish this up by jumping into our 100 envelope box. We have $40 remaining, which we're going to add our $40 to our box. So we have a 20 and a 20. So let me fold this 20. I need two envelopes here they're both stick together like they already knew that I was adding 40 dollars $40. okay so we okay there we go so we add our two 20s there two tens I'm sorry and then we have a 10 and a 5 over here which we're going to add to this one Okay, now we're going to add our sticker. So that's one. And that's two. All right. So let's put our book in between where we left off. And let's add our 20s to our box. So we're not doing that bad, guys. Um, since we started the twenty dollar challenge, we have stuffed these already, although we have all these remaining. But we're doing well. So that ends the stuffing of the nine hundred and sixty-five dollars for today. It was a great stuffing. I feel good. I've put up one hundred and seventy dollars towards saving and one hundred and sixty-five in my high priority. So I feel great. Um, well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I know it was a little long, but I know you guys enjoyed it, right? So thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. I used to work the day away. I figured I could maybe pave away. No, it's niggas account.